Some say that Wily kidnapped Mr. X and held him hostage somewhere and took on his persona, his uh, image or whatever you want to call it. And some say he's, there's no such thing as Mr. X and that uh, you're just pretending to be somebody named Mr. X. I think you can uh, destroy those hard hats with the most powerful shot of the power Mega Man. I believe you can anyway. Maybe I'm wrong. I'm not sure. Well, let's try. Let's find out. Oh, yes, you can. How oh, nice. And we need Jet to get up there. Alright, Jet is going to be useful here, along with the Senchar Flash. Ow. That was dumb. Skip you. Oop, watch out for that guy. And another one. If there's only one of them, I'm not going to bother with Senshar Flash, but if there's multiple, I would have. Like this part here. Alright, we want to utilize Jetpack now. Alright, so we want to... Use our jetpack here. There are two pathways you can take, both which require the jetpack, so let's check them out. Got this part here, which we didn't manage to get to, but no big deal. Another Senchar Flash works. And we still need the jetpack for this area as well, so. Just take this guy out, and you gotta use your jetpack a bit early, or you'll fall onto the spikes. Like so. Here we got another pain in the butt area. Once again, use your jetpack early. Like so. And... There you go. That would be the regular area, the regular path to take, and you would land here. And this would continue on to the level. But we want to check out the secret area as well. So if you use your jetpack here, and try to time it a bit early, as I said. Push up like so, and we get here. Smash through this area, and we get to a secret area. Full of goodies for us. Such as... An E-Tank, which we do need because we used an E-Tank against Mr. X. And we got a bunch of energy if you want to fill up. And we got this area here, which will fill up on your regular weapon energy. So if you need to stock up. And we fall down to the same area. Easily avoided blade. There we go. And some more energy of both kinds. Let's see if Beat can take this guy out. Wow, one hit. But look how much energy he used. Almost all of it. I guess it just depends on how much energy the enemy has. So he is pretty strong. And one nice thing about this game, he uh, doesn't go back to you every other time like in Mega Man 5. One hit, come back, one hit, come back. He just attacks like crazy until he beats them. No pun intended, so... Alright, for the first boss, we got a dragon. No, it's not the dragon from the second game, don't worry. Sort of his younger brother, I guess. He's certainly smaller. He threw, shoots out platforms to you, and you need to shoot him in the eyes. So that's what we're going to try to do. He shoots out flames, being a dragon and all, as you would expect. Oops, I shot him in the mouth. There we go. Ow. Oops.
Give me another platform, please. Darn, I missed. There we go. Just shoot him in the eye several times, and he's toast. Alright, one down, three to go. Moving on to Wily Stage 2. If Mr. X was Wily, then doesn't that mean that both castles were Wily? Well, they were Wily because he was impersonating him or being him, I'm not sure. So in any case, I guess it wouldn't really matter. Oh. Ow. Watch out for this guy. You can stay on the ladder here and shoot him safely. Alright, we got two pathways once again. Which pathway? Well, the ice icicle area is easier. So let's check that out. Just use jet and then flame blast. Oops, I missed. But the path is now open. So we'll just go along here. I believe we have shield enemies coming up, so let's switch over to POW. There we go. Easily avoided. And if you need to get this from this area, just fly over. And it's that simple. And you continue with the level. Or, we can utilize the jetpack once again. And try and skip some of these blocks. I hate these disappearing blocks, as you all probably know if you've seen my uh, other Mega Man playthroughs from before. You know how much these disappearing blocks piss me off. So we'll go up here, and what do we got here? Oh. More of these guys. I hate these guys. You gotta beat them fast, or they'll hound you and never let you go. Oh, we got an E-Tank. That's our prize. Not that we really need it, but what the hey. I just well get it because it's there, right? And we got a big fat juicy weapon energy once again. Let's go with B. I'm not sure which one the automatic energy bouncer would have filled up, but... Beat's a bit low, so we might as well go with him. I don't think we need Y-Spear anytime soon, so we just utilized it. Oh, well, there's another one. What difference does it make? That probably filled up Y-Spear. Since it's lower than B. This part's annoying because of the spikes above you, and it gets higher and higher with these guys. You wanna... It's good to utilize the uh, jetpack. Make sure you don't hit the spikes and float down slowly. But don't go into the pit, obviously. Who do we have here? Oh, this is the bubble machine, or whatever it's called. Weak to the windstorm. If you're fast, you can beat it when it's practically off-screen, but I'll just show it to you. Explosive bubbles. Have you ever heard of a bubble exploding? I haven't. That easy. Every time you hit it, you have to push back so you can kick its bite right off the screen if you want. Two down, two to go. What about these six down, two to go if you're considering both castles as wily? 